If you have been playing Mafia City for a while now, then this video is not for you. You should probably click off the video. But if you've just recently downloaded Mafia City to complete one of the offers in other games or other apps, then you've come to the right video. In this video, I'm going to be showing you the quickest way to get a 5 star vigilante in the game. There are a lot of different vigilantes in the game, but if your goal is to get a 5 star vigilante as quickly as possible, then you should get one of the three blue vigilantes that can be bought using gold. The only three vigilantes that can be bought using gold are Adriana, Catalina, and Charles. Out of these three, Adriana and Charles cost 13,000 gold for 1,000 fragments, and Catalina costs 8,750 gold for 1,000 fragments. So it is best to try and get Catalina for this task. You need a total of 9,900 fragments to get any vigilante in the game to 5 stars, and the game gives you 300 fragments of Catalina for free for playing the game for a few minutes. So to get her to 5 stars, you would need the remaining 9,600 fragments. You can buy the first 9,000 fragments for 8,750 gold per 1,000 fragments, then you can buy 500 fragments for 4,375 gold, and finally 100 fragments for 900 gold. So getting the 9,600 fragments will cost you a total of 84,025 gold. Now this amount of gold cannot be obtained for free on a new account within a short period of time. You'll have to spend to get this gold. It costs about 120 to 150 dollars if you know which packs to buy and when to buy them. However, there is a way to get about 13,000 gold for free in a few minutes after you've created a new account. This will reduce the cost to about $120. Here's how you can do it. First, you'd want to create a new account in the game and get it at least to Mansion 2 or up to Mansion Level 5. The next step is to use your newbie teleport item and move to an old city. However, the city number should be above 1000 and it should also be an active city. One of the active cities that I know of is city 1139, so you can move there if you want. To use your newbie teleport, you need to be at least mansion level 2. Tap on the teleport in your inventory and select use to use it. You then search for the city that you want to move to and then you simply move to it. Make sure you move before you upgrade your mansion to level 6 because once you've reached mansion level 6, you won't be able to move to a new city. Once you're in city 1139 or whichever city you've decided to move to, and once you've reached mansion level 5, you click on the Godfather's Monument and then select City Tasks. These are tasks that need to be completed by the entire city for you to get rewards. However, since you've moved to an old city that is also active, almost all of these tasks here are going to be complete and you'll be able to get a ton of gold from here immediately. That is around 6,000 gold and you'll also get enough speed ups from here to speed up your mansion to level 6. Once you've claimed all the rewards, you then speed up your mansion to level 6 and go back to the Godfather's Monument again. This time you select Event File. There will be a total of 7,000 gold to be claimed from here, so in total by now you should have at least 13,000 gold. This is how you can get 13,000 gold quickly in the game. For the remaining 71,000 gold, you'll have to buy packs to get them. The best event to buy packs to get bonus gold is the gold rebate event. So if you're going to do this vigilante upgrade task, make sure you accept it during the gold rebate event. This event gives you 100% extra gold on your first pack and 40% extra gold on all other packs you buy during the event. Now the packs keep changing every time so I can't really give you a fixed list of packs that you should buy to reach this goal. However, if you have a $100 pack available that gives you 30,000 gold, you want to buy that pack first to get the 100% bonus so you get a total of 60,000 gold. If you can find a $100 pack that gives even more gold, that would be even better but those packs are extremely rare. Also, if you can find packs that give these gold gift boxes along with the 30,000 gold, I'd recommend buying those over other packs that give only 30,000 gold, simply because you can then use these gift boxes from your inventory to get even more gold, and if you're really lucky, you'll get just enough gold to get Catalina to 5 stars. Once you've bought the $100 pack and used your gold gift boxes, 
you can buy the smaller gold packs. For example, this luxurious gold pack that gives 4500 gold for $5. But not only that, you'll also get a 40% bonus from the gold rebate event, so you'll get a total of 6300 gold. And you also get these gold gift boxes which will give you even more gold when you use them. If you're not sure when the gold rebate event starts, then I'd suggest downloading the Mafia City game first before you accept the offer, wait for the gold rebate event to show up, and then accept the offer. Obviously, you can also play the game a little longer to get a bit more gold if you want before buying packs. However, doing so won't really give you much gold. It'll maybe give you about 5000 gold or so in 7 days if you're really active and invest a lot of time in the game. And that won't reduce the cost much. So that was my advice on getting Catalina to 5 stars as soon as possible. Now keep in mind that Catalina is a blue quality vigilante. However, if you're trying to get a purple quality vigilante or a gold quality vigilante to 5 stars within a short period of time, that'll cost you way more than $100. It'll probably cost you over $2,000, so I definitely don't recommend doing that. Before I end this video, I'd like to thank all of my patrons for the support. You can find my Patreon link in the description. Thanks for watching the video guys, and I will see y'all in the next one.